Hi, my name is Rahul Kashyap. I'm one of the research physicians at Mayo Clinic here. I hold an academic rank of assistant professor in anesthesiology and perioperative medicine. I'll be talking about today the manuscript title Saddle versus Non-Saddle Pulmonary Embolism, Clinical Presentation, Hemodynamics, Management and Outcomes. We are excited to present our work of one of the largest cohort of saddle PE because there are relatively sparse data to guide clinicians on how to manage saddle P patient. That prompted for us to have this study designed. Our aim was to better define the clinical presentation and outcomes of a large cohort of saddle P patients. Also, we compared the clinical presentation and outcomes of saddle PE patients with a matched cohort of non-saddle P patients. A total of 187 consecutive saddle P patients were identified at our institution from January 1st, 1999 to December 31st, 2014. And these saddle P patients were matched with two factors, age and SPASI index, which stands for Simplified Pulmonary Embolism Severity Index. They were matched with one-on-one -on, -one on a cohort of non-saddle P patient cases. We also used DDQB, Data Discovery and Query Builder. Now it is called ACE, Automated Cohort Explorer. It is an efficient way of pulling the data with minimal errors. The take home message from this manuscript is, although saddle P patients tend to present with greater hemodynamic compromise, they have a low in-hospital mortality rate, which is similar to an age and severity matched cohort of non-saddle P patients. Thus, we suggest that optimal clinical management of saddle P patient should be based on initial as well as delayed hemodynamics status rather than the location and extent of anatomic clot burden. Thank you. We hope you found this presentation from the content of Mayo Clinic Proceedings valuable. Our journal's mission is to promote the best interests of patients by advancing the knowledge and professionalism of the physician community. If you are interested in more information about us, our home page is www.mayocliniceproceedings.org. There you will find access information for our social media content, such as additional videos on our YouTube channel or journal updates on Facebook. You can also follow us on Twitter. More information about healthcare at Mayo Clinic is available at www.mayoclinic.org. This video content is copyrighted by Mayo Foundation for Medical Education and Research.